Top of the day to ya. It's me, Stephen Thomas, with ReportsOnHousing.com. I'm a soccer coach, and some days the sun feels as if it's scorching hot. Mistakenly, I've worn black sweatpants or forgot to bring my hat, and it's those days that I want to escape the sun's heat. With interest rates at lows that date back to the fall of 2016 and a limited number of homes on the active listing market, housing is as hot as the sun. It's time to wear shorts, sunglasses, and your favorite hat. Housing is typically hottest from mid-February through mid-May. The spring market has arrived and the heat cranked up right after the Super Bowl. The slower market of 2018 and the first half of 2019 now seems like a mirage to most buyers. For a minute, buyers seemed like they were finally going to get the upper hand, their turn, but that all disappeared. Here we are in 2020 and housing is sizzling hot again. Once again, buyers are tripping over themselves to purchase. Homes that are priced well according to their condition, location, and upgrades are fetching multiple offers within the first couple of days. The bidding war days are back. When a home generates 15 offers to purchase, there is only one winner, meaning 14 buyers need to go back to the drawing board. After a couple of failed attempts, many buyers sharpen their pencils and write extremely aggressive offers, willing to stretch the price a little bit, even if it means paying more than the most recent comparable sell. This market can be extremely frustrating for a buyer. It's all due to hot buyer demand fueled by low mortgage rates. Patience and a comprehensive strategy are a buyer's best bet in finding success. As of the end of February 2020, the expected market time, that's the time between hammering in the for sale sign and opening escrow down the road, for all of Orange County dipped to 48 days. That's a level we haven't seen since 2013. When the expected market time drops below 60 days, the market is considered a rock solid seller's market with steady price appreciation. Last year, Orange County never dipped below the 60 day threshold. It appears as if 2020 is going to be blazing hot. Warning to buyers, with an extremely low mortgage rate environment, the market is not going to change anytime soon and tilt in the buyer's favor. The market is lined up in favor of sellers with tremendous demand and a very low supply of available homes to purchase. Do not sit on the fence and wait for the market to change. Values are on the rise. Many buyers talk about timing the market. That is an exercise in futility and result in prospective buyers kicking themselves down the road and wishing that they had pulled the trigger a lot sooner. A warning to sellers, do not stretch the asking price much at all. Overpriced and overzealous list prices result in wasted market time and do not generate offers. Pricing at or close to the fair market value is the wisest formula for success. It maximizes demand immediately upon coming on the market. I am Stephen Thomas with ReportsOnHousing.com. If you'd like the latest updates on the market and future trends, head over to my website and subscribe today. With your subscription, bi-weekly market updates are sent directly to your email as well as a quick summary and plenty of charts. So if you want to stay ahead of the market, make sure you subscribe today.